soliciting money eh, on behalf of uh, aspirants. Yet they are the real aspirants, the people you see me are the real aspirants of Jubilee in, in, in Nyanza. And we are putting those people on notice, and even the provincial administration, that they need to be dealing with the bona fide gazetted aspirants in Nyanza, so that we can uh, campaign for Uru Kenyatta, for his votes, their votes, and to mobilize votes for him when he's coming to uh, Nyanza to We know as a fact, that there are people who are bent on having this narrative that Luo Nyanza cannot support uh, His Excellency President Uhuru Kenyatta. And they are going outside there masquerading that they are the ones who have the mandate to be able to get votes for uh, uh, the President and, uh, and, and uh, I don't know for who else. But we are saying these people who are here, they have come out clearly to say that they are the candidates and they have been cleared they have been gazetted, and these people who are going around say that they are the ones who can be able to organize even for the, for the agents without consulting even the, the candidates who are on, at the local level from ward to the constituency to the governor position, we are saying this must stop. Jubilee as a party has got a framework on how they do their things, it's a party and we have the way information flows, eh? as we stand now, as an aspirant for Homer Bay governor, all aspirants of Homer Bay are their leader. Eh? And that is how Jubilee works. For Kisumu County, the leader is Atiena Tieno. And for Sierra County, likewise.